Hey guys, Jagus here, Jagus Reviews. Alright, so I just wanted to take a quick look at the Philips. This is the 4000 series, so I believe this is the 4207? 4207, something like that. Anyways, you can get it on Amazon about $74. And it is the smallest Bluetooth speaker that they do. It is in the same lineup as the X7207, just the smallest version. And then they have one size bigger that's kind of like the JBL Extreme 3 size, I'm pretty sure. So this is tiny. This is like probably the size of maybe a JBL Flip. Definitely not the charge category at all. But I figure why not give it a go, see if it's worth 74 bucks. We'll put it up against a Flip. I'm going to be buying one of those super soon. So it has one racetrack driver they're all doing that now and then two passive radiators so no tweeter or anything it's pretty small so it'll be interesting to see how this sounds bluetooth outdoor speaker yeah so let's see what we got here ipx67 dust and waterproof bluetooth multi-point built-in mic for call so you can take calls with it pair for stereo which is good and up top it's a little hard to see, but we got a power button. Looks like this is the link button, Bluetooth, play, pause, up and down, and then your battery indicator. And here's the package. Let's see what comes in it. Oops. All right, so it does come with a little charger. It's USB-C, which is good. And then we've got Okay, it's a 4807, S4807. So we just got our little booklet and one more. Perfect, and let's go ahead and see how we sound here. All right, I'm just gonna play some top speed, just see how it sounds, and we'll put it up against some other speakers in its size category. Let's go. About halfway up. Speed it up, speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. Speed it up, 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 speed it up. Go faster, ay, go faster, ay, go faster, ay, go faster, ay. Don't wake up, go down. Pray to God like a nine. I'm um, put that on my. I'm put that on my gun. On go like three to one. Don't smoke, I need my lungs. I stack and feed my funds. I'ma do this as fun. Ayy, I'm blasting. Ayy, don't matter. Ayy, can't match it. Ayy, go faster. Ayy, speed it up, 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 go faster. Ayy, go faster. Ayy. Go faster, ay, go faster, ay. Don't you do you, I don't mean. I'ma take this overseas. I'ma do this for my seeds. Why your hair is bling bling. You heard top speed, that's me. You heard that it up, that's me. You heard way up, that's me. Do some speed dial, full blast. See how it handles some bass. Hey. Definitely not hitting low hurts. They been on it, drum on the rail, I wrap it, I bag it, I pack it for sale. I feel like I'm speed out, I hit me chill, I give it a thrill, I put it on film. Just make your mind. I just wanna make your mind. I just wanna make your mind. Mind, my mind. Mind. Mind, my mind. mind. I just wanna make your mind. Mind, my mind. Mind. Mind, my mind. mind. mind, my mind. I just wanna make your mind. All right, so I think that gives us a good little idea of how it sounds. Um, honestly, so I'm used to 
reviewing like huge speakers i'm used to them hitting super low in the hertz and everything obviously you're not going to get that with something like this but out of the small speakers i've been able to test so far and i'm going to be getting more this thing definitely packs a little punch like i'm i'm very surprised with how loud it gets especially for how tiny it is like it is definitely just a small little tiny weighs like a pound it's like two inches wide all the way around by maybe six inches five inches something like that so nice little packs of punch sounds good the bass is there it's punchy super punchy little rumbly it's got good mids and the highs are surprisingly good for not having a tweeter i don't know i'm sure it does make a difference having a tweeter with speakers this size but like I said, I haven't really gotten like the JBL Flip 6 or the Charge 5 yet. So I will be getting those since I am going to be starting to do some of these smaller speakers now. But let me know what you guys think. I think it's a good little $70 speaker. It's right in that same price range with the JBL uh, Flip 5. No, Flip 6, sorry. And um, I think the Flip 6 is a little more. Maybe around like 100 or something like that. But... It sounds good. I'll put it up against that um, speaker I got from Walmart, the On Round, and I've got a couple other little ones. We'll start putting them all up against each other and stuff. But let me know what you think. What do you want to see next? And thanks for watching.